Yo YouTube. YouTube MC if it's here bringing you another micro video. Um <clears throat> I have got a bit of a sore throat just a second. And I will be showing you um my world that I made called Time Machine Advance. But actually on the website I put it on it's called Awesome Time Machine. I did record it yesterday but EasyVid just crashed and I had to do it all over again today. So basically you just spawn here, you actually, you actually when you download it you spawn here, but I spawned over there because that's where I was last time. So basically, um, here's your time machine, you've got an ender chest, it's got a really cool looking thing like a flat plane or something it's got a clock there so you can see the time changing so when you push this button what happens is the clock starts spinning and then when you get and then you get here and the year is 2037 and as you can see some of the trees have some more trees have grown and some were trees have gone oh wolf. I'll sit you up for later ah can't sit him up stupid thing fine anything in the chest no there's nothing in the chest so anything and also these are made up names as well so don't go on it and think it's my name or my friend's name or something or like my mum's name So, yeah, let's travel further in the future. Whoa, this has gone crazy. You do have to look at all the books in this map, by the way. So, like, go in every chest. Right. There's a book. What does it say? Get to the future and fast. I hope they fix that wood problem in the future and stop mobs ruining everything. Yours sincerely, Doctor. I might have spelt a few things wrong. But I've seen other maps with things spelt wrong. And then there's diamond swords, flint steel, and just loads of gold everywhere. I love my Buddha. Anyway, so, yeah. And then when I push this button, it will take me here. Oh. And there's another chest over there. But look how futuristic it's got now. As far as Minecraft goes, it's quite good. Okay then, right. Thank God it's fixed. No more la fire, lava, and mobs. But sadly, I don't think it will hold them forever. Sad face. Happily, it's not the Great Fire of London anymore. Yeah, it's about a year ago when I wrote it. P.S. Don't tell the government that. I know this. But they put us two metres below the ground so we can't escape easily. And if they catch us trying, they'll kill they'll kill and bury us on the spot so look around and if you want you can make a bed and live here but make sure to stop at the future to see what will happen like will everyone be dead or will the world be saved or what p.s. do not look in the hole behind the three story house these are my last words till I die J just don't read the rest of it because it says him coming back to life. See, there's one that says to read it, and then it's P.S. Even though the one that says P.S. is actually longer. Hi, Iron Golem. Right. He said not to look in the hole behind the three-story house, but you all know what I'm going to do. Look in the hole. So, 
so I'm gonna come here. Wait, who's that? Doctor. 1000 BC to 3000 AC, killed by government four. For what? Towers! Oh, I'm talking to her head. Do not dig the grave or be haunted. Brackets, there's loot. Oh, as long as there's loot in it. Right. I wonder what could be in a coffin underneath someone's grave. Oh, it's their body. He has got a pickaxe and diamond sword, though. Nah, I won't get it, though. And then there's nice flowers. It did take me quite a while to decorate it all properly because um, this is actually where the ground is. See, because there's grass, and I just I had to do an extra layer, and that's what gave me the idea to put you further underground, so you can't dig your way out. So yeah, I think there's enough villagers here. Maybe we should go see the future like he told us to. Just a second. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go... Take some with me. There you go, I'll take a bit of this with me. It's okay, all of this will be fixed when you play it. Because I put it up for download before. Uh, I'll put it in this chest over here. Right. You don't have to do that, I just did it for me. Whoa! That sign's on. Oh, and this is like another AC thing, like BCAC. Where another religion comes out, maybe. But yeah. So then you spawn here where there's loads of fire and stuff. So the only thing that you can assume is there's been mobs. And also when you come on it there'll be some pigmen um, eggs down here and some dirt block over there. Just mentioning. Oh, an iron block as well. That'll be on your walls then. Right, there's a chest. Let's go read it. Right, there's one called Exit 1, and there's one called Exit 2. Exit one. The only way back is to the past is to die. Sorry for putting you through this. Right, two. Thanks for playing. I'll make more maps in the future. So look for more maps by me. Unless this map is new. Can't remember what it was now. I'm just going to put it over there. So like, I'm guessing the moral of the story is that ch chests last forever because like, in every single one, there has been a chest. Anyway, so I have to go die. Bye. Blah, 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 blah.